Hi guys, it's Johnny from Yanomize and welcome back to This Week at Yanomize, episode 37. It's pouring down with rain, however, we got to shoot it for you guys at home. Let's go inside. First car, Bentley, satin grey. Wrapped this a little while ago. A customer is now coming to pick this up. It was clean, it's obviously wet now. We have a Range Rover here. This has been wrapped in satin black. I think it's having wheels, calipers as well. It's also got a chameleon tint on the front. Let's have a look at this. Um, everyone keeps going on about this chameleon tint windscreen. Oh, nearly walked into the car. Have a look at that. It looks like an oily effect. I'm seeing loads of people do this. Are we feeling it or are we not feeling it? Is this the new thing that is happening at the moment? Is this legal? I don't know. Let me know. As we head into the back, look at this cool Smarty. Um, this looks like the, um, oh, what's it called? Uh, what's, the, what's the effect? <laughs> Brabus Smart Car is in. It's got like gold decals already on it. I think we're changing it slightly. This looks like, um, I'm sure it's like a cigarette brand. I can't think what it is, but I'm sure I'll ask someone and then L will just throw it on the screen. The Blue Square GTR is still here. That is now complete, waiting for the customers to come and collect it in the pouring down rain. However, it still does look very, very good. Brand new spanking box fresh Rolls Royce Wraith out of HRO in um, London. That is here for a full stealth, 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 everything. Black, 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 black. The customer can't decide whether to go satin black all over the car or do a two tone. So satin black around the bottom half and then gloss black over the top half, but it's gonna be a chrome delete as well and wheels and tints. Um, then you've got a little Brabus in the corner. Got a Range Rover here in satin black. Um, this is in for, I think the customer scratched the door. Uh, so we're gonna redo that. We're gonna head in there, because it's wet. Hi, Eamon. So as we head into the old unit, old unit? Yeah. Barney, the dinosaur. Chrome purple, gloss black, shuts and returns. Nico Mark working on the rear bumper. What do we think? This is gonna split opinions. I always say that when we work on certain cars with certain colors, I'm personally feeling this. Um, Nico Mark are struggling with the rear bumper. When I say struggling, not struggling, it's just very, very difficult actually. That's the, that does them an injustice. I'm sorry, I'll take that back. Not struggling. I'll be honest, if I wrapped, that's how I'd finish my panels. Who wants me to wrap their car? Who wants me to do a rap video of me rapping? Why are you laughing, Pav? I'm not. Why are you laughing, Pav? I don't know. That's what fuck. Did you and Andy call each other this morning? Twenty bucks. <laughs> anyway, that's Nico Mark. They're working on the rear bumper. Um, how difficult? Uh, this one is hard and tricky. So hard and tricky, eh? Pause. By the way, this is we're in our own little bubble here. Everyone here is in their own little bubble. So um, when people say, "Why are they not wearing masks?" They're brothers. We're all brothers. Greek Filipino brothers. Um, these are my Greek brothers over here. This is Pav. Hi, Pav. Hi. That's Andy. You might remember him from last week. He's still here. He did get the job. Uh, welcome to the family. Welcome. Uh, we are doing a roof lining for this Lamborghini Aura. Starlight roof lining like the Rolls Royce. Um, Pav is there doing everything and Andy's there doing everything. Yep. Who's doing what? Who's doing what? Quick, give me a rundown. Um. I'm drilling holes, he's cutting lengths and we're both gluing and we're just looking at it now. Mm. Trying to loom it up. Yeah, looming up's a nightmare, but um, it's looking good. It's the looking good. First one that we've done on this, so. Maybe we'll drop a little, Kieran, do you want to do a little quick light off, please, for me? That looks all right. That looks all right. Well, I like the fact the heat gun's still going, yeah? <laughs> turn the light on, turn the light on. <laughs> the heat gun's still going. Why there's no lights on? Um, did you see Mark quickly put his phone in his pocket? Yeah, I saw that. He tried to pull it out, took the light on, but he's like, okay, the lights are back on. I saw it, Mark. Andy, how was your first week? It was good? Loving it. Yeah, you enjoying it? Absolutely, it's yeah. first week, you've got plenty of time to hate it. Yeah, bad. <laughs> <laughs> don't, don't be easy on me, don't take a look at my age or... Nah, don't worry about that. So no? Been all right. So no one's taking a look at you? Not yet. Okay. Go. Let's see what team he supports. What team do you support? What, 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 what colour is London? Blue. It would be red. He didn't even say white. Aren't you Tottenham? Yeah. Yeah, and he said blue. He tried to get away with the Chelsea, but yeah. Chelsea, no, 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 no. I definitely not Chelsea. No. Definitely not Chelsea. Anyway, he spurs another one to him and Sal. Both of them. Anyway, they're cracking on with the roof line. I think I'm actually going to do Starlight roof line in my Urus as well. So let's go into the back and chat to Sal. Right, so before I head into the back, Sal is a Tottenham diehard supporter. And I found out that he said on Friday that if Tottenham beat Arsenal, when I go into the back, he's going to be like, 
Oh, Jan, oh, I must have fallen asleep in this and he's going to pull out his Tottenham shirt. So I was like, okay, you're going to be clever with me. However, they lost. Arsenal won 2 1. I've got an Arsenal shirt here. So um, let's get him back. Let's head into the back. So, as we head into the back, we have another Lamborghini Urus. Hi, Self. Yeah. How are you? Very well, thanks. PPF? Yep. Um, gloss, accents, and full stealth. Whole car? Oh, so it's like a matte PPF? Yeah, conversion. Okay, so this is box fresh, 21 ridge. Um, I'm loving this. Uh, by the way, have you seen the new Yanomai uniform? No, I haven't. No? no? I got you one. <laughs> What, what this, mate? What, what, the Arsenal shirt? What happened to your team yesterday? It was one of those days, wasn't it? Was it? Yeah. Oh, was it? Yeah. So little birdie told me that you were going to try and pull a Tottenham shirt on me today if you lot had won. Backed fire, didn't it? Backed fire, didn't it? Didn't it, Sal? <laughs> I love it. Don't try and get one up on me. Come on, the Gunners. Anyway, that's Sal. This is the PPF room, and Sal, one to me. See you later. <laughs> so, how are we feeling? Not good. Not good at all. Could have been better. Was you actually going to pull out the Tottenham shirt? Yeah. I was uh, going to be wearing the shirt whilst I was working away, and uh, just say, yeah, you know, couldn't get it off from last night. Not even my missus could get it off me. <laughs> I think this is the angriest I think I've ever seen you. Oh, you know? mate. The closest I've seen to you snapping. Absolutely gutted. So gutted. Was you angry yesterday? Oh, mate. Fuming. Fuming. Whole day ruined. Literally, weekend gone. And this week is probably finished as well. Andrew, Andrew's a gooner like me, okay? At the Reds. Sal tried to be clever with me, yeah, with a Tottenham shirt. Didn't quite work, did it? Because they lost. <laughs> you going to try and get me? Didn't happen. Okay. I was gonna say, I knew about it. Did you know about it? I told you about it. Oh yeah, you, oh yeah, he told me I about told it. You oh about yeah, it. I was thinking. How did I know that? Because this morning, South comes and goes. I had it all planned. I was gonna come there on the T-way, whip out the Spurs shirt, fail. Thank you. So Andrew told me, and then South suffered. South, now you know who grassed you up, mate. <laughs> At least happy as well. <laughs> So, before we head into the new unit, last week we reacted to some comments. So, you enjoyed it last week, here's some more. Right, so the comment Els has given me today is, I've got one question, how is the deer? Unfortunately, the deer died. Um, it lost against the fight with a smart car. I had to drag it off the road, watch it pass away, get in the car, and carry on coming to work. We are back in the comment reactions, and I got a new one for me here. Hey, Ricky. Can we call you hap fit now? No. Come in, Ricky, please. <laughs> that was very serious, bro. <laughs> that was really serious. Do you want to do another one? But that one's good, though, but I'm, I'm probably keeping that in. <laughs> yeah, keep that one. For Yo, last one who call me hap fit is dead right now, you know? So don't call me like that. <laughs> hey, Ricky, can we call you hap fit? Of course you can call me anything, my brother. Cool. <laughs> I don't want to be nasty. <laughs> so this one here is a really, really long comment, but all I'm, I'm going to pull out the end. He just put, why don't you put tyre shine? Um, tyre shine is silicon based and it doesn't work with the wraps. If you put it on the tyre, it rises up and can, it can cause the vinyl to lift. And also when you put tyre shine on, when you drive the car, it sprays up down the side of the car. Um, and usually when we finish the cars, the customers take them away straight away. So. That is why we don't put tyre shine. Yes, I know you can get tyre shine, they're not silicon based and they can really, really dry on the car really quickly. It's just a personal preference for me that I try to keep the cars very, very clean. So the customers, when they get home, the car's still clean and not covered in stuff. Danny Sherrard, who's commented, Salv is definitely the hardest. The man is a gangster. Well, I'm glad somebody recognises that you never muck around with a Sicilian. Do you do apprenticeships? <laughs> <laughs> again, again, again. No, Samir, we don't. Does PPF cost more than a vinyl wrap? Um, PPF costs quite a bit more than a vinyl wrap, uh, material-wise and labour-wise, on a car like this. 
will probably take double the time it would take to do a vinyl wrap. The product's self-healing, so it's got multiple layers in the, uh, the actual PPF, whereas the, uh, the vinyl's got just a single layer with your adhesive. Overall, a lot more expensive. Kian was definitely that kid in school who cheeky comments got him thrown out of the clash by every teacher. And I mean, yeah, that's kind of true because I hated school. I never wanted to be there. I wasn't there most, most of the time, to be honest with you. But yeah, I hated school. So I just wanted to be working and get out of school. So yeah, I mean, it's kind of true, kind of not, you know. <laughs> <laughs> this is the best tea way I've seen. I love that moment that everyone was laughing. Keep up, guy. Nice work. And hope Yanni will start making some rap videos that show more work getting done. I love the very, very, very old videos. Seven to 12 minute car rap process. Uh, we've actually started making those videos again. Loads of people sending comments saying, can you start making rap videos again? So if you click here, you can actually see the gold Porsche GT2 RS wrap. If you want to be featured in T-Way, drop us a comment down below and I'll ask that individual, whether it be Nico, Mark, Gina, Bert, Andrew, Enrique, whoever. So as we head into the new unit, the first car we see is a satin black i8 with gold decals. Naomi is doing the gold decals. How are you getting on? Good, it's nearly finished. Nearly finished? Yeah. What is this, gloss gold? Uh, it's not satin, is it? It's gloss. Uh, yeah, it's gloss. Yeah. Is this, is it his company colours or anything? Or is it just he just wanted it to look like this? I'm not sure, I'm thinking maybe he just wanted it because there's no logos or anything. Okay, what's interesting, obviously the smart car outside is the gloss black with the gold, and this is obviously satin black with the gold. What does that the smart car, what brand does it remind you of? Oh, is he smoking the bandit? I was saying JPS or Lotus. JPS or Lotus, okay, so there's a few. Wasn't there like a cigarette brand? Yeah, oh, is that JPC I don't smoke? He's a proper smoker. Um, I was gonna say something, but I didn't. Huh? Trans Am, yeah, so smoking the bandit, JPS, Lotus, um, what was that one? That's it, smoking the bandit, JPS, Lotus. What is JPS? Oh, John Paul, John Player. Ah, oh, John Player Special, there you go. Kids, don't smoke, it's bad for you. I definitely don't smoke weed, even worse for you. Right, okay, so BMW X5, um, I think this is box fresh. It's an electric one, 45E PPF. Um, so it's having its final check now before the customer comes to collect it. We're keeping it inside because obviously it's pouring down with rain. Mr. Obama Yang's Lamborghini Aventador Roadster is here. Um, it's coming for wheels. Um, just like a little check over on the wrap, it's been a while now. And that's it. And obviously Arsenal won yesterday, so happy days. My Aventador.sv is still here. It's still here. Something is happening with it. Who knows? Who knows? For now, it can just stay there. To be fair, someone keeps trying to buy it off me. I'm not selling it. Um, Kian is here. How are we? I'm all good. Did you have a good weekend? Yeah. How was Cardiff? I didn't go back to Cardiff. Actually. You stayed down? Yeah, I ended up uh, just staying here this weekend. R rumor has it you and Terry went on like a bike ride together. <laughs> I thought you were going to say that. Yeah, we went on a bike ride. Oh, did we? <laughs> How was it? It was good. We ended up getting lost, but we were like two hours. Did you hold hands as you were riding the bike? <laughs> no, no, no. <laughs> Whatever, innit? Enrique! You okay? Yeah, yeah, I'm not too bad. How are yeah, you? I'm, not too, I'm not too bad, I'm not too bad. How are you? Yeah, I'm good, yeah. You good? Yeah, lovely weekend with the family. Yeah? Yeah, yeah. Spent some cash with my mother-in-law. Spent some cash on your mother-in-law? Yeah. Right, obviously, got to spend cash on the mother-in-law. It was Mother's Day, so happy Mother's Day to all the mums. Everybody. And, uh, yeah. Well, okay, everybody. Maybe just the mums. Just the mums. Just the mums. <laughs> okay, uh, rear bumper on the i8? i8, yeah. i8, okay, you good? Yeah, Happy? Yeah, yeah. Everything good? Yeah. Okay, say bye. Red for the week. Red for the week. He obviously supports Arsenal. Arsenal? Arsenal? Arsenal, 100%. Yeah? yeah, yeah. Okay, I didn't even know that. There you go, something new. Um, I think I'm going to end the video. Rio is here. Hi, Rio. How are you getting on? All right. You all right? Did you work it out that was a 45E on the back? Yeah, I realised after. I still Did don't you? know what it is. Still don't know what it is. What do you think the E stands for? I ain't gonna be able to hear him from there. Huh? I ain't gonna be able to hear him. Don't worry, I don't need to hear him anyway. It's fine, just give, just give him some air. Right, okay, so that is the end of this video. Um... Finished? Right, so that's the end of this video. Thank you, Chris. Thank you so much for watching, guys. Make sure you're subscribed to my personal YouTube channel. It's right here. I've got a new house update coming tomorrow actually so make sure no i'm filming it tomorrow it'll probably come at the end of the week anyway thanks so much for watching guys and i'll see you soon take care